Hi, this is Paul Solt from iPhone Dev TV, and in today's lesson, we're going to learn about version control. Version control is the concept of keeping track of your software as it changes over time. As you add new features, as you fix bugs, you're going to change source code, you're going to change your resources, you're going to change settings in your application. And sometimes these changes can cause issues that you can't recover from. So if you've ever done anything where you've copy and pasted a document so that you could have an old version and then a new version, that's the same type of thing that we're going to be doing here, except it's all automated and it's all sort of automatic and provides a lot of great features. So here is GitHub. This is a Mac app that connects to the GitHub website. And we can look through my brew coffee repository. So this is what I'm working on. I've got some source code that I've already started. And I'm just testing out features and trying different things. This has been something that I've been doing for several years now. And, and now is a time where I'm trying to actually make it so I can sell this on the App Store. So it's really taking it all the way to the App Store. So what you're looking at is my private repository. And we can see changes that I've done. So when you edit your storyboard files or when you edit your code files, you'll see pluses and minuses. And the, the colors will show you when things are added or when things are removed. And this is really handy because we can go back in time. So it's kind of like time machine. We can travel back in time. If there's an issue or if there was some bug that we introduced at an older point in time, we can jump back to that. We can fix it or we can just continue using our application. So we're going to learn how to use this as well as the website GitHub. This is where you can set up an account. It is free to set up and you can work on your code there. This is really convenient for team environments. If you work in a team project, you can see commits that other people might do. So here you can see working on a project with another person, we have a ton of different uh, bits of source code that we've worked together to create and upload and post to the App Store. All right, so that's version control. We're going to learn how to use this in your iPhone app projects because it's going to be really handy to keep you from shooting yourself in the foot and ruining the entire application because you can always jump back and revert if you have a problem you can't figure out.